Okay, so hi everyone, I'm Celia and I'm one of the members of the Purple team. In this presentation, we're going to talk about Type R Gym. We've decided to choose a gym after trying out the sports related equipment such as treadmills, yoga mats, and bikes during some of our metaverse sessions. On the other hand, the three of us are active people who like to go to the gym on a regular basis. So we thought this could be a nice idea. Now, Alvaro, who is the, who is the team's leader, will briefly explain the company and its services. Hey, what's up? Equilateo Toy Power Gym is located in Santiago de Compostela, the capital of Galicia. This gym stands out for its boxing and cross training classes, but also offers activities such as junior boxing and preparatory training to enter the Spanish State Corp. Another aspect to highlight is its fully equipped uh, weight room. Currently, the staff consists of three coaches and specialize in boxing and other sports disciplines. Type Park facilities are not too big, but are enough for its uh, 370 uh, clients. They have recently opened another gym in another of Galicia's major cities, A Coruña. Customers are very happy with, it, with this gym for its friendly and approachable staff. In addition, the schedules are very flexible with 10 boxing and cross training classes per day. The race might seem a bit expensive, but you have to keep in mind that the gym is in the city center and that, and that all sessions are led, led by a qualified instructor. L'Oreal is now going to talk about some of our ideas for introducing Thai Park in Second Life. Okay, <clears throat> to begin with, the first thing we have considered is that it would be necessary to have a place, preferably rented, to simulate how the gym looks in real life. With this, we will buy all the equipment that Thai Park has so that people who are interested in joining can see how the gym actually is without the need to actually go there. IPAR will also provide services for those who want to work out in Second Life only and not in real life and the rates could be slightly lower than if you go to the actual gym. This will encourage people who have been working out virtually but have not yet taken the step to go to the facilities to sign up for Taipar. That's all. We hope you all enjoyed our presentation and thank you very much for watching.